Hi, my name is Reema Hadi. I'm a plastic surgeon at the Swan Clinic and today we'll be talking about how to perform your own skin self-examination. Everyone should have regular formal mole checks, but in between you can do your own skin self-assessment. To start off with, you need a few things. Firstly, you need some good lighting, a mirror, and a friend to help you see the areas that you can't see. You also would benefit from having a camera to help take photographs, even a phone camera will do. Now we start off with areas to examine. You start off with the hair as the moles can occur in hidden areas too. And then the back of the neck. Then you look at the ears, behind the ear, inside the ear, and along the top of the ear, which is called the helical rim. And then the face, which is divided into upper third, middle third, and lower third. The lower eyelids and the lower lip are common sites of skin cancers as they tend to catch more sun. Don't forget to check the temples. Then you move on to the front of the neck, the chest area and the tummy area. Then I would check the front and the back of the arms and don't forget the hands and in between the fingertips. The nail area is often forgotten and also making sure that uh, you examine in particularly between every single finger. Then I'd move on to the back and here you definitely need a friend unless you're very dexterous with a mirror. Then I would look at the feet and in between the toes should be checked as moles of the soles of the feet like the hands are very important. Melanomas in this area can thicken quite a lot before you even detect or notice a change. Then I would move on to areas covered by the underwear. Here the mirror is handy. Don't forget to check these two and mel as melanomas can occur in areas that are never exposed to the sun. Now just please to remember to take this as general advice. Make sure you see a doctor if you have any suspicious lesions and please don't hesitate to contact us if you have any questions. Thanks very much for watching.